What is going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do a clean screen shake in Sony Vegas. Now just before I get into this video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. Now yes, I have also made a tutorial in the past showing you how to screen shake, but that was using the event pan and crop. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do this with a video plugin. Now this plugin does come at a cost, but you can also get a trial for it, and you'll see it is definitely worth it. So it's from Sapphire Plugins, as you'll see this is their website, a link to this will be in the description. As you'll see if you come down, it says try Sapphire for free. You can request the demo, and there's more purchase options. So as you can see, this is the purchase options, and here's what you can get. You can get Particle Illusions, Sapphire, and the Monster GT. Completely up to you which one you get, but of course, just try the trial first, and check out this video I'm about to show you. So the clip one we're using is from my Disneyland vlog, it was up yesterday. If you haven't checked it out yet, a link to it will be in the description. And yeah, all I'm going to do is find a part where I want the screen to shake. So you can see, we walk through here, and then uh, let's say I want the screen to shake right here. So I'm going to split the clip. And I'm just going to go a bit more, choosing how far I want the uh, screen shake to last. Three seconds, I think it is. Yep, that's three seconds. I'm going to keep the rest of it. So this is what it's going to be like. This is just going to be normal all here. Once it hits this clip here, it's going to start to screen shake. Now, saving so much time instead of using the event pan and crop, or even track motion, depending which one you use. This time, simply come to your video effects. S underscore shake, which is the sapphire screen shake, and simply drag and drop on your clip. Now believe it or not, the effect is already applied. And we have this here, where as you can see, you can mess with a whole lot of things. However, the default one itself is very good. I'll show you right now, so I haven't touched any of the settings yet. If we play this through from the beginning, normal, normal, and then look at that, look at that shake. And then it goes back to normal like that. You can see it turns out pretty nice and it doesn't show any of the black bars. So if we come back to the video effects, and as you can see, this is where you can customize a whole lot of stuff. So the amplitude, the frequency, and the phase, they're the ones you should touch because they're the ones that will do the most effect. So I'm going to put both the amplitude and the frequency up, and then I'm also going to put the phase down. Now, if we X out of this and play it through, you can already see right there, there is a massive difference. That is because the frequency has gone all the way up and the amplitude. So, frequency, of course, changes a whole lot of things and so does the amplitude. So, if we just slow them down a bit, remember the phase is still down. You can see the screen shake is happening. And if you can't tell the screen shake is happening and you're probably thinking it's just a shaky camera, well, look, my Twitter logo or my Twitter icon is still there from the rendered video. And you see it's just moving around everywhere. Just like that. So yes, it is from Sapphire Plugins. It does come at a cost, however, as well as the shake. You'll see, you'll get all of this right here. Everything you see with S underscore is from Sapphire Plugins. Like that. So many different things. In addition to this, they have some transitions, as you'll see right here. And they also have some media generators. Now, no, they have not paid me to promote this I'm doing this free will the reason I'm actually showing you this is just showing you why it's worth the money and in case you think buying a screen shaker is the only thing you're gonna get no it's not you're gonna get a whole lot of things anyway that's it for this video I hope this video has helped you and now hopefully you can use this in your videos be sure to go follow me on Twitter I'll keep you updated when you're posting and what we're posting also be sure to go ahead and check out my gaming channel where I post four times a week and finally check out my snapchat which will show you what I do throughout my day. See you guys being casual savage here. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.